What's up, YouTube? You know, please like, subscribe, and comment, man. My YouTube algorithm. But today is, has been my first day on the road, like actually dropping and hooking and picking up loads and containers and stuff like that, man. And guys, man, it's been, you know, good learning experience. It's been pretty fun and stuff like that. But man, I am tired man, already, bro. Like I can tell you guys, I'm tired. My back is really tight and stuff like that. Right now I'm in some warehouse now and we're figuring out like where we're supposed to take our container at, like where are we even supposed to go? A lot of stuff like that. I got caught at my OC for like three hours. That's what really has me tired right now, man. Like, I got caught at my OC for my company for three hours. And like at first they wouldn't let me get out. I'm gonna get, let me get back with you guys. So yeah, guys, back to my first day. Right now, I guess I'm like weighing my tractor and my trailer. I guess it's like I had to park it in there really, really good just to weigh everything. But this is the yard and everything, man. I'm about to drop this uh, container and this trailer and keep it rolling, man. So you got a lock, you can't get the turn. And this is to unlock it. Oh, now it's unlocked. Now they can take it off. Okay. Man, this is what they got me on my first day. They got me doing so much extra shit, man, that the first day steward said, dude, but you know I'm a dog, man, so you know, that's why they gave it to me. He's literally using this as a groom, man. He's using it as a broom, man. That's crazy. Hold oh, on, wait a minute. Next, well, good alignment. As you guys can see, this is kind of my marker from here with this edge right here, and this is what I'm coupling. Gotta let it down just because of my height, it's not right. Let it down, I'll get my fifth, my landing feet. <laughs> my locking pins are locked in. My brake drums, no instructions. My brake pads, they're all good. Got a chicken on that side. Come all the way around. And this, guys, is my coupling. I'm actually with one of my trainers right now. He's a little more cooler and stuff like that. Let me kind of record this for you guys. So I'm a little happy about that. But again, lock, looking at my tandem pins, looking at my brake pads, make sure there's no instructions or anything in between them. I can make this tractor and trailer fall when we are backing from it. So, I did my alignment test and everything like that. I got under there and made sure my alignment was all good. Let me check it again, though, so you guys can see what I'm talking about. Are you coupling? Have to make sure your alignment is no more than two inches to the right or the left, no more than two inches, which is not. So, it's pretty good alignment. Then you gotta check your height. I just raised it down. We are all good. Let's make our secure couple. Yes, sir. And to make a secure coupling, we call this a PAL. Right, Big Mike? That's right. So, making sure my locking draw is right around my kingpin. And it's locked, it's pretty good. And there's no space between my apron and my kingpin either. Yes, sir. Then my landing gear right here, guys. No, no, no PA Airlines. Air right. Push Connect the airlines. Too. Don't forget to push your handle. Yep. Make sure it's all, all the way. Yeah. Make sure the handle's in all the way. It's in there. Now oh, you make a good connection. So this one I connect my airlines to this right here, man. And this is a good connection with your airlines, man. It's all connected. Lights is on. Now I go to my landing gear. Yep. This is when I fully raise it now. PAL. So you pin your landing gear. You lean your feet all the way up. 
And I still have problems with this mic. Sometimes, man, I don't know what side to go on, man. So if you guys first start doing it. Some of them go opposite from the other one. Yeah, so don't feel bad, because I'll be out here sometimes, I'll be confused. One day I go on the left side, it does it's something different. One day I go on the right side, it does something different. So, so yep, it's doing this just to finish my secure coupling, man. And this is what it is. I did have to do a tug test too. Couldn't get the tug test on camera. I wouldn't want to record. Yeah, I wouldn't even want to record while driving. But the tug test is pretty much if you put your car in neutral, well, in drive, it's in the first gear and you tug on there, you know, you hit the gas kind of hard, but not too hard. And you give it two tugs just to make sure that your tractor is connected to that trailer pretty good and it won't like break apart. So, boom, get all the way up. And you connect it, man. This is your coupling. 